Hello, in this video I'll show you what to do once you've published a job listing on MaxList. I'll go over the management tools in the employer dashboard that you can use to organize and track job applicants, candidate communications, and documents that you receive from applicants. Let's start with managing your applicants. If you chose to manage applications through MaxList when you posted your job listing, you'll be able to view all the applicants and their application documents right from your dashboard. So click on Manage Applicants to get started. Um, this is basically MaxList's version of a simple, easy-to-use applicant tracking system. When you land on this page, it will show every applicant who ever applied for one of your jobs. So to filter and view applicants for a specific job, filter the list by job on the left side of the page. Select the job that you want to look at and click Search Applicants below to view the people who applied for that job. The list will update to show all the applicants for the specific listing and you can then click an individual name to view the applicant's profile. So here you can see the applicant's information. You can also see their profile if they filled one out in their MaxList JobSeeker account, and you can see the documents that they uploaded with their application for your job. This is everything you need to review the candidate. And once you've screened an applicant and reviewed their documents, you can add notes here. You can also update their rating as a candidate, so based on your, your uh, screening, you can select a rating, and you can update the status of their application. So you can view um, screened here so that someone who looks at the other applicants knows that you've already screened this one. So using these tools is a great way to manage the applicants in your process and make sure that you've reviewed and responded to all applications, which is really important for candidate experience. And as the hiring process goes on, this is a great way to um, filter by rating and status so you can quickly see your top candidates and who's still in the running. And don't forget, your applicants list is a resource when hiring for future jobs. So check back on the folks who, inter who interested you in other jobs but who didn't land the jobs that you've hired for in the past because those folks might actually be a great fit for your next opening. That's it. Thanks for watching this video. If you need more help, feel free to email us at info at maxlist.org or call us at 503-517-2773. Thanks for watching.